Ayan, hello guys! Welcome again to another vlog. So this is our fourth day. So I mean, four days in park hopping in Orlando. So we are going to Universal Studios. So we only have limited time to spend in here because flight time is in 6 30 so we have to leave by 3 p.m. sa park and so maaga kami pumunta mga 9 o'clock we are there already and we got in and it's so easy to go inside just present your ticket and voila. so since maaga nga kami the line is still short so talagang Maluag dito sa Universal Studios compared to Disney. <laughs> Here you can breathe, which is a good thing. Ayan. And also, the queuing area of the lines is uh, much interactive compared to Disney. So, mas enjoy talaga dito sa Universal. Pati yung theming nila sa rock. Patok na patok. At siyempre, since Harry Potter fan tayo, so diagon alley so we started yeah. walking clockwise <laughs> it's easy to navigate here because it's circular lang yung map niya. and um so madali mo malolocate yung mga places so we went straight to the diagon alley yeah, and then we passed by a different attractions <laughs> babalikan na lang namin after harry potter <laughs> Alright, so yeah, and Coca Cola dispenser, that's where you can refill the cup that we bought yesterday. And yes, keep on walking, keep on walking, my lap it now. Alley is? So you have to go where the red building is, you have to go inside the red building. Inside the red building. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Oh, nice. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh, it's the night bus! Better than the Philippines bus. That's the shrink bus. Welcome to Diagon Alley! Oh my god! Oh my god! One of the best rides that you can go here is <laughs> there is a bank of blue water. Oh, it's nocturnal. No, that's not that. You should line up to this one. And then your one, you can also use it here. Her. And you can also go to Olivander's to get a show of the
The passage to your left will take you to a pair of lifts. The lifts will take you down to the car station. There you will board a car for the journey to the vaults beneath the grave. Be warned that it is not for everyone. Muggles might describe the journey to the vaults as a high speed, roller coaster ride with sudden and dramatic acceleration, climbing, stopping, and diving. I wasn't able to take a lot of videos these days because it's uh, super tiring and super hot. But for me, I must enjoy King Universal because there are more rides that uses 3D and 4D features and it's easier to navigate. So here are the list of the rides that we went to from best to not so much. You can search them on other vlogs if you want to know which one is the best for thrill rides or for shows, different kinds of attractions that you want. And they have good dining areas too. For adults, I'll, re I'll recommend you go to Universal Studio because you can drink, there's more ride you will enjoy, less line, less children around. And feeling ko yung ambience mas maganda sa Universal. But if you want your children to enjoy, you go to Disneyland. Kung gusto nila talaga makita yung mga Disney princesses and characters. And also spend more time in Disney if you wanna explore everything there. Kasi two days is not enough. But here in Universal, two days is enough, I guess. So that's it for our four day theme park hopping in Orlando. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Charot. <laughs>